Welcome to your daily devotional reading from the book My Life Today. Month of November, a victorious life. November 28th, with peace. Acquaint now thyself with him and be at peace, thereby good shall come unto thee. Job 22 verse 21. We embarked in a small boat which has to convey us across the channel to the coast of Denmark. Here I was provided with a stateroom containing two sofas and shut in by heavy curtains, accommodations which we then thought hardly necessary for a day journey of only six hours. We had occasion, however, to change this opinion before reaching land. The first hour we spent on deck in the cheerful and well-furnished ladies' cabins. The weather was pleasant, the sea smooth, and we anticipated an enjoyable trip. But soon the captain, passing through the cabin, advised us to go below and lie down at once, for we were coming into rough water. We complied though rather unwittingly. In a short time, the boat began to rock violently. We could hardly keep our position upon the sofas. I became very ill, now in a profuse perspiration, as if every organ was struggling against the terrible malady and then overcome by deathly seasickness. Death seemed very near, but I felt that I could cling with the firm grasp of faith to the hand of Jesus. He who holds the waters in the hollow of his hand could keep us in the tempest. The waves of the great deep obey his voice, hither thou shalt thou come, but no further, and here shall thy proud waves be stayed. I thought how Jesus calmed the fears of his disciples as he stilled the stormy Galilee and should I be afraid to trust to his protection who had given me my work? My heart was kept in perfect peace because it was stayed on him. The lesson of trust I learned during these few hours was very precious. I have found that every trial of life is given to teach me a new lesson of my own dependence and of trust in my Heavenly Father. We may believe that God is with us in every place and in every trying hour we may hold fast that hand which has all power. A Victorious Life, November 28th